once more. Orange clouds hang over. I'm the grandmother. I've got a two-year-old granddaughter. What life will she have? I'm terrified that she's not going to have a livable future. With droughts, with wildfires, with excessive temperatures, and with crop failures all over the world. Where do you think we get our food from? Crop failures all over the world, leading to mass starvation. You are free. He's not with us. The press is Well, I'm, I'm, I'm protesting because it's important to get the government to just stop issuing new licenses of fossil fuels. The government's approach is genocidal. The scientists, 98%, I think it is, of climate scientists, disagree with the Prime Minister's approach. The United Nations describe our approach as immoral and economic madness. But all our successive Prime Ministers have done is increase the problem, not decrease it. And so I have to protest. The protest. I have to protest. The protest. I have to stand up and be counted. I cannot follow or respect a government that, that treats my fellow citizens the way this government is So, pick a side. Join us. Prime Minister, next Saturday, 10 o'clock? No, 12, 12 o'clock. Yeah, next Saturday. I'm I'm developments in the North Sea. I mean, they know. Don't they have children? Don't they have grandchildren themselves? I just don't get it. I don't understand why the government is looking only at the short term in terms of profits. Um, it's just um, unbelievable, I think, that this is being taken care of. Hello, I'm Edwin, and I support the Just Stop Oil. And I think that um, fossil fuels have no place in our world today. Um, and I believe in a healthy future for the planet. Um, because I want my children to have um, a good life. And I'm terrified about the impact that climate change will have around the world, particularly in the third world. And I think there's no alternative but to stop using fossil fuels.